Minnesota Fighting Vikings cornerback room is young, injured, and depleted, uh, but they bolstered it uh, a bit this week as they signed second-year cornerback Dylan Maben off the Raiders practice squad. Because uh, as of right now, the Vikings cornerbacks against the Lions are Jeff Gladney, Harrison Hand, uh, if he gets over his hamstring injury, Chris Boyd, if he doesn't get cramped up, as well as Chris Jones, who's been here for five minutes. So great cool. Uh, due to COVID protocols, uh, Mabin won't be available for Sunday, but he'll be ready to go and practice next week uh, in ahead of the Bears Monday night football game. So get to know the new 53-man roster cornerback. So background, Dylan Mabin, 23 years young, uh, 6'1", a buck 96, uh, 2019 UDFA out of the Fordham University. Uh, he's the younger brother of Jordan Mabin. You may have uh, heard the name. He was an NFL cornerback who went to Northwestern, had a couple cups of coffee with the Ravens, Browns, Falcons, uh, and Chargers. Now, it came out of, is it Macedonia or Macedonia, Ohio? Either way, uh, but was very lightly recruited, uh, signed up with Fordham, go Rams, was a three-year starter, uh, 41 games in college, racking up 159 tackles, only one interception, but had 40 passes broken up. Now, the low interception numbers are likely because teams just didn't like to throw his way. Pretty damn good uh, for Fordham. Uh, also was a special teams ace, uh, averaging a career 22.1 yards per kick return, as well as serving as a gunner on punt and kick coverage. Uh, he was a two-time All-Patriot League player, uh, team captain senior season 2018. Also was on the uh, Patriots League academic honor roll, which you love to see, uh, plus a degree in political science. Uh, pro day, pretty nice pro day. Uh, six, uh, measured at six foot, a buck 96. Ran a 4-4-140, which would have been fifth best at the Combine 2019 if he had been there Amongst cornerbacks, uh, also uh, the vertical leap, 38 inches, a uh, buck 30 on the broad jump t- would have been tied for six for cornerbacks. Also decent short shuttles as well as three cones. When undrafted, small school, okay production, okay measurables, uh, but he was uh, signed up pretty quickly uh, by the Raiders as UDFA. Was in camp with them, uh, played in 13 snaps their first preseason game against the Rams. Uh, had one target, it was incomplete. Roads close. What up? I uh, was on their practice squad all of 2019 uh, before going on injured reserve in December 2020. Was on the practice squad uh, and then was elevated to play eight special team snaps uh, week seven versus the Bucks. Uh, you know, with the whole practice squad 55 man roster whole thing, right? Uh, and then the Vikings uh, decided to sign him off the practice squad and bring him here to Minnesota. Welcome in, like Greg Lewis. So pros, uh, Dylan Maben, a warm body. <laughs> I, I mean, as cynical as that sounds, that, that really is about it. But also, uh, every player that comes in through those doors is going to have a very decent opportunity to get some playing time because what else are the Vikings going to do at this point? I, he does have ideal length. He's got nice height, uh, nice wingspan as well. Uh, solid measurables, uh, you know, speed, agility, explosion, etc. Also has a lot of experience on special teams, so he could bring some value in that regard right away. Cons? I'm proven, uh, you know, been the league two years, uh, only has eight total special team snaps, zero on defense. And also, uh, unfortunately last year only played a one preseason game, only played 13 snaps. Of course this year, uh, no preseason there. So not a ton to go off of, uh, also coming up from a small school now, small school, uh, getting in reps, uh, against high end competition and practice and preseason would be extremely valuable, uh, for a young guy, but it is what it is. Uh, and also working against him is he's coming in mid seasons, coming in cold, right in the middle of the damn year. Now, it is important to note that Paul Gunther uh, has been the Raiders' defense coordinator since Gruden came in in 2018. Because uh, John Gruden, uh, he loves him the double A gap look, right? And Gunther was Zimmer's protege in Cincinnati. Actually, ended up replacing him as defense coordinator when Zimmer came over as the Vikings head coach. Uh, Zimmer even tried to bring him to Minnesota, but no dice there. Uh, so uh, you know, look at the Raiders, and a lot of their concepts are similar, especially in the secondary. Uh, so that could be a small edge, small little head start for Maven coming in. So overall, I think it's a good signing, and also against the Bears pending on what happens Sunday and if guys uh, in the cornerback room are going to start getting healthy or not you may see Dylan Maven just pick six BDN Nick Foles no big deal yeah bring it on but uh, Dylan Maven welcome into the Vikings and hope you're ready to play (laughs) because you're probably going to have to. Uh, but your thoughts, let us know in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support that work? Pull some of the Venmo but until next time Skoll Production Value